Good morning, everyone. This is Lindsey Hellison back in the building with another SPS Monday Motivation. Hope you guys had a great weekend. We know it was a wet weekend, no doubt. Shout out to the Henry Ford Trojans. They still got it in. Rain, sleet, or shine. Uh, the 30th class reunion for the class of 1993. Did it big. Uh, didn't let the rain stop. I appreciate the love and commitment the Trojans have. Uh, I was there in spirit, uh, just warm and, uh, and and dry inside. That was what was going on with me. So with that being said, what do we have happening today? What is today's Monday motivation? You know, I always talk about my Monday motivations are from life experiences or pulling from the headlines. And I can just remember having a uh, experience recently and it really got me to the idea that we have to be reminded that when the lesson is a blessing see sometimes in life we get we take l's things don't happen right for us you know you may take a loss and we say well i don't take losses they're all lessons but with that being said there's this parochial educational aspect that makes you feel like it's like being back in school teacher writing on the chalkboard or on the ipad nowadays right uh the whiteboard saying today's lesson and we don't really take it with grace we kind of eat it you know you take a loss you learn a lesson and that's it but what about when the lesson is a blessing when this lesson that you have is really something that can really help you going forward for example you know we can define lesson as an amount of teaching given at one time a period of learning or teaching. Yeah, I love my PhD program. I love, you know, learning this great information. But for anybody, after a while, the educational part can get old. It can be tired. But we look at it as a blessing. Blessing is being defined as God's favor and protection. That's totally different. It's one thing to learn a lesson. Okay, I learned a lesson. I won't let that happen again. But when that lesson is actually a blessing, it's actually God's favor. It's actually some protection from something you don't know about. It gives you an opportunity to have a little bit more depth. I think that's really important. That's a great perspective to have. In order to change and grow, you must learn more than you know right now and be more than you are right now. These are not my words. That's an anonymous quote. But in order to change and grow, you must learn more than you know right now and be more than you are right now. So sometimes these lessons that we take on begrudgingly, these lessons that happen in our life that we really are not too interested in, we have to recognize the blessing in that because that's going to force us to grow in a way, force us to see something a little bit deeper, give us an opportunity to see something now that we can be prepared for later. So I'm saying is, the next time you have a bad experience or something doesn't go your way, think long and hard about how this experience may actually positively impact your life. Who we have right here? Got Michelle Mimi Walkers in the morning. Good morning. I just saw your recognition for New Breed Track Club. You were recognized for your great, outstanding community service and work. Congratulations to you. I knew about it for a long time and many others know, but now uh, that word is out. Congratulations to you, Michelle, and all you do for the young people impacting their lives. I'm just talking about the fact that remains here, guys, and I won't be too much longer today. The reality is that Look deep into those lessons. Don't let it just be something that you learn from, but recognize the blessing that it is and how it can help you and how it can keep you and how it can guide you and how it can help you be someone for someone else. Michelle says, thank you. But other than that, guys, I just want you to keep going today. I want you to have a great day. I want you to have a great week. Uh, this being uh, you know, close to mid-August, I mean, we'll be wrapping up the summer soon. We'll be shifting soon. We'll be getting into the fall months and a different type of experience and different things happening. Good morning, cuz. How you doing, David? David Eric Hyde says, good morning. Good morning to you, man. I want to wish you all the best. Hope you're doing okay. And we just want to say, hey, when a lesson is a blessing, you know, you learn something, but it's also a blessing from God to keep you out of the way. also want to continue to thank uh, SPS Strategic Partner, the Detroit Wayne Integrated Health Network, for all the support. Uh, great resources that are out there and available to everyone that you can check out from a mental health standpoint. You can follow them on social media as well as uh, download the app, whether you're Android or Apple, you can get a whole lot with that. But Detroit Wayne Integrated Health Network is doing amazing things, and I'm grateful for their support going forward. Uh, Michelle also says, lessons can definitely be a blessing, especially if you root from the lens of positivity. Wow, Michelle, thank you for kind of bringing that home. I think that's the important part. You know, we look at lessons as, oh, man, I got to go through this. I got to learn this, and we do it begrudgingly. We don't like it, but it's about your mental shift. It's about having the right attitude, looking at it from a lens of positivity. You can say, you know what, this really helped me. And that was the experience I had. I had something that happened, but I realized that, wow, I'm glad this happened because it allowed me to step back and gave me a greater perspective to help me going forward. And again, you can say, well, Lindsay, that's a lesson. But no, but when you count it as good, when you count it as something that's going to really help and enhance your life, that's a positive thing. So I just want you guys to know, 
realize that when the lesson is a blessing, that's a good thing. It's okay to be taught something new. It's okay to get a new perspective and learn something. But don't think it's something you got to just eat and be okay with it, but say, you know what? I'm grateful for this because it's going to make me a better person. It's going to have me in a better position to positively impact others going forward. So with that, I want to let you guys get to your Monday. I'm going to get out here and get it going. I want to wish you all the best. Uh, hey, let's continue to enjoy what we have going on and go from there. Michelle says, thank you for being a part of the journey for Kay. Jeff, she's learning, and you've blessed her. Oh, man, she's so awesome. I saw her awesome video uh, with the low, with the shout-out and everything she said uh, and how she's moving. And uh, you forget the kind of people you impact over the years, but I'm glad to have been a part of that and glad to have made an impact on that and continue to have an impact on great individuals, not just athletes like Kyra Jefferson, but others as well. But we'll continue to do the walk together and uh, make positive impacts with others and continue to recognize that when there's a lesson, there's also a blessing too. David says, uh, I recently found a lesson in the situation that was first traumatic, finding after time it was needed for growth. Hey, I know about that. I'm glad that uh, the heavy experience that you had that many of us couldn't even relate to that you can find that. So that was very timely to hear you say that, to know that uh, even if it's something that you had to go through that you may not have really wanted it to, you didn't welcome that, but you're able to find a blessing that. And then also, brother, you're here. Your traumatic situation was one that, you know, you didn't have to be here after that. And you're here. So I'm grateful and I just continue to hope that you can continue to have the support that you need to go forward. And uh, I'm just grateful that uh, you're here to tell that story. And that is a blessing. That lesson was a blessing. So, guys, with that being said, this is Lindsay Hells on SBS. I'm going to let you get to it. I'm going to get to it as well. Have a great day. Have a great week. Have a great month. Have a great year. Have a great life. Appreciate you guys' support. And I'll see you next time. Peace.